Imagine setting sail on a five-year journey across the world, not knowing that your discoveries would change the way humanity understands life itself. Welcome to the story of Charles Darwin, the man who forever altered our perception of the natural world with his theory of evolution by natural selection. Charles Darwin was born on February 12, 1809, in Shrewsbury, England. As a child, Darwin was fascinated by the natural world. He spent countless hours collecting beetles, studying plants, and observing animals. Despite his interest in nature, his father sent him to study medicine at the University of Edinburgh Medical School. However, Darwin found the lectures dull and the sight of surgery distressing. Darwin's neglect of medical studies annoyed his father, who sent him to Christ College, Cambridge, where he studied theology, but his passion for nature never wavered. It was at Cambridge that Darwin's love for natural history truly blossomed, thanks to the influence of several professors who recognized his potential. In 1831, at the age of 22, Darwin embarked on a journey that would change his life and the world forever. He was invited to join the HMS Beagle as the ship's naturalist, tasked with collecting specimens and making observations of the flora and fauna around the globe. This journey would prove to be the defining experience of his life. As the Beagles sailed to South America, the Galapagos Islands, Australia, and other remote regions, Darwin had the opportunity to observe a wide variety of plant and animal species. During this voyage, Darwin began to notice the differences and similarities among species on different islands, particularly in the Galapagos, where he observed finches with varying beak shapes adapted to different food sources. After returning to England in 1836, Darwin spent years analyzing his findings and gradually developed the theory of natural selection. The idea that species evolve over time through a process where individuals with favorable traits are more likely to survive and reproduce, passing those traits on to future generations. In 1859, after more than two decades of research, Darwin finally published his seminal work on the origin of species. It was a scientific bombshell, challenging the accepted views of creation and sparking intense debate. While On the Origin of Species was met with both acclaim and criticism, it gradually gained acceptance within the scientific community and beyond. Darwin's ideas provided a unifying framework for biology, influencing countless fields such as genetics, paleontology, and ecology. His later works, including The Descent of Man, further explored the implications of his theories, including the controversial idea that humans share a common ancestor with other animals. Charles Darwin passed away on April 19, 1882, at the age of 73. Darwin's legacy continues to inspire scientists, educators, and thinkers, reminding us of the power of observation, curiosity, and the willingness to challenge established ideas.